Hi everyone, today I'll be giving you tips when moving out for the first time. I'm Kristen Stampini, now let's get started. Moving out for the first time is incredibly exciting. It can also be a bit overwhelming, especially if you haven't had a lot of responsibility before in terms of living on your own. But in between the excitement of finally snagging your own place and the apprehension over having to leave your comfort zone is a list of things that need to get done in order to make the moving out for the first time as seamless as a process as possible. Don't you think? We have a full list that you can always reach out and get that will help you through the process. Now that it's your turn, stay until the end of the video for the five steps you should follow when moving out for the first time that will help you ditch the apprehensive and embrace the excitement and create a new comfort zone that's all your own. So tip number one, figure out your finances. Let's start with one of the most stressful parts of moving out for the first time, financing your new life. Even if you have a job or student loans that are in your way, it can still be incredibly worrisome to suddenly take over tasks of not just paying your rent, but also having to paying stock in your fridge, your student loans maybe, or other expenses. And also you know, your electricity, internet, and so on. And to buy all the home essentials that somehow magically appear in front of you before, and also things like maintaining the home. So your first step here is going to be to make a budget. To actually do it, stay by totaling up the amount of income that you'll be bringing in each month as a general rule of thumb. Your rent should really not be more than about 30% of this amount anymore and you may find your budget stretched too thin in between paychecks. Don't get discouraged by this process. It can be frustrating to see your budget dwindle as you take out more and more responsibilities associated with living on your own. But it's better to know what is working with than to overspend and end up in a sticky financial situation. So tip number two, figure out if you want to live alone. You can always get a roommate that can take on half your expenses. If you decide that you want to live alone, ensure that you can be responsible, do so within your budget guidelines. If it's going to be too much of a stretch, consider signing a six month lease uh, before you buy, maybe get a roommate, get a roommate when you actually buy a place or rent a place. So just always remember, always have the end mind and goal of what you're gonna need to live alone. Are you gonna need to get a one bedroom instead of a two bedroom or a two bedroom instead of a three bedroom? Tip number three, figure out how to do basic lifestyle tasks. This isn't to say you have to be a master at living on your own right off the bat. There's always the internet to refer, and actually YouTube, right? Just like what you're on right now. So when you've got a question about how to do something, Google it or go on to YouTube and you can usually figure it all out. You'll be glad you did. So tip number four, figure out your moving plan. Moving can actually be very expensive if you have to hire people to do it. You know, before you can live on your own, you have to physically make your move and that's a process that can be stressful. Make sure that you know exactly how you're gonna do it and if you need people to help, what's the cost gonna be if you need a moving company? So my best recommendations is make a plan, give yourself plenty of time to take on each task so you don't stress yourself out too much. So what does moving entail? You know, some of your biggest to-dos include figuring out whether you need to hire movers or rent a truck. Since you will be moving out for the first time, 
chances are you don't have a ton of furniture, maybe you do, uh, to transport and may be okay moving to your own. But if you do need to hire movers, use uh, our free moving company directory to help you and also our directory for everything else. Just ask for a copy of it and we'll be happy to share it with you. So I hope you like this video and we have all sorts of tips on moving out for the first time. So just reach out to us. If you like this video, hit the bell icon to get future videos. And also we put out weekly videos and subscribe to our channel. Thanks and have a great day.